Celosa, so, Celosa is uh, is is a uh, is clearly uh, uh, the new uh, new generation. We say uh, tequila uh, is it, it can be the future uh, or in the tequila category. Um, after, of course, uh, been seeing uh, uh, the blanco that everybody's been drinking. Um, a long time ago, uh, we're starting seeing uh, different, I would say, range or uh, expression of uh, of the same brands in the tequila, uh, such as like Reposado, Anero, Extra Anero, Cristalino, and uh, the rosé cate- rosé category, uh, the rosé tequila, uh, was not existing at all. Uh, it, it is actually uh, very new. A few brands um, launched uh, the, this category. Uh, slightly before us, uh, like a couple of years ago, two years ago, I think. Uh, but I think we have maybe two or three brands that are doing uh, uh, mm. this uh, expression of tequila. Celosa uh, is first um, uh, high-end tequila, very haute couture. You can see by the design, uh, the shape, and of course the color, uh, pretty feminine. Uh, uh, also Celosa um, in Spanish means jealous. Mm. In woman jealous, <laughs> not man jealous. Uh, and um, our idea was really the vision we had on creating this, this tequila rosé uh, was also in purpose for this, uh, I would say, uh, uh, this profile of, of, of women that like good spirits, uh, but want something smooth, uh, not aggressive, uh, but also elegant, uh, sexy. Uh, and uh, don't get me wrong, I think uh, women at some point uh, hold the world. Huh? Uh, yeah, and, uh, and it's been uh, it's been true that um, uh, also uh, this tequila category uh, explodes definitely uh, because uh, during parties, uh, men were buying what women wanted to drink on tables. Yeah, for, so uh, of course for champagne, but tequila came very quickly after. Mm-hmm. And uh, it made sense completely to create again this rosé rose style design shape for... for, for so uh, for how, how did the tequila get its uh, pink uh, ro- rosé color? So why, why, why it's pink? Uh, it's a very Côte Provence, Côte de Provence, uh, minute uh, kind of... Uh, clear uh, rosé color. Mm-hmm. Um, it's in purpose, of course, and how uh, we made it, uh, it's uh, after the, 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 the process of distillation, we aged uh, our very high-end, top-quality Blanco tequila mm-hmm. uh, to, um, uh, into a, a, a red wine barrel, a Merlot mm-hmm. barrel, uh, that comes from Napa Valley for 21 days. Mm-hmm. Uh, and not more, mm-hmm. uh, not less. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's, um, it's because we want to have this color, natural color. Again, there's no chemicals. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, we also want to have, through this finish, um, a, 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 I would say a palette, uh, when you do tasting, a palette and final that get into the vanilla profile, red fruit profile, and again, smooth, but without any uh, sugar additive that you can see uh, and uh, in many, many, many brands uh, taking brands today. Mm-hmm. So, uh, no, Celosa, it's certified ABV proof. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's quite a revolution in the, in the tequila world. Uh, of course, in USA, we couldn't call uh, this tequila tequila if it was not 40, 40, 40% ABV proof. Mm-hmm. But in other countries uh, in the world, we have this opportunity to reduce uh, the... Um, The, the degree, uh, mm-hmm. the, quali- the, the quantity of, uh, of alcohol. Uh, again, to make this, uh, this juice more affordable uh, and uh, something you can sip uh, or through a cocktail uh, with a Paloma is absolutely delicious. Um, uh, but like all time long without being drank very quickly. Mm-hmm. Uh, so uh, no, it's a... Uh, I would say chilled uh, on the rock uh, with Paloma Margarita uh, is uh, is very mind blowing. Uh, uh, amazing, uh, amazing product. Uh, I, I was very, very impressed with it. Uh, I, I think, uh, yeah, that a lot of our lady customers would uh, would very much enjoy uh, this drink, and hopefully next time they they are going out, this becomes their to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, absolutely. Ask. Uh, And, and if they want to party, we uh, we even have uh, uh, 
in Abu Dhabi now, the, the Magnum format, yeah. uh, which for party... Uh, yeah, it's very, very impressive. Very impressive. And uh, don't get me wrong, the rosé uh, by itself, like the, the rosé wine, it's something that uh, in Europe, uh, uh, women, men really like uh, to enjoy uh, for lunch uh, or uh, on the beach uh, uh, during what we're doing like uh, you know chilling around the pool yeah. a swimming pool or uh, and ha having this uh, lower ABV also allows you to let's say enjoy more of it over absolutely. a longer period of absolutely. time absolutely you're cruising longer yeah very <laughs> good yeah cruising exactly <laughs> yeah, we all love to cruise <laughs> <laughs> so no, so no so it's, uh, it's something new to test and uh Um, and I think, I, and I think, just to to, to, to finish on Celosa, for people that uh, has uh, you know uh, by association maybe bad memories uh, of, of tequila, mm -hmm. uh, drinking tequila rosé can really uh, you know uh, how can I say this? Um, um, uh, con con it can con uh, reconquire yourself. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what. It, it it can make you rediscover tequila. Rediscover tequila, yeah, exactly. Rediscover tequila in, 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 in a in a elegant way. Yes, very yeah. elegant way. So the, the yeah, I mean, you can see it's uh, it's again it's very old couture. Uh, the the cup is in marble. Uh, it's handmade. Uh, and to to make the transition with Adelita, mm -hmm. um, it is made in the same. Uh, Area on mm. Altos de Radisco. So, uh, Adelita is is, is, uh, is, is this bottle, is this one, yes. uh, and um, so they both made in the same uh, uh, localization, uh, which is Altos de Radisco. Altos de Radisco is like Grand Cru in Champagne, oh, wow. um, and uh, we we can even say that both tequila are single estate te mm. tequila. Our partner um, is the, the the owner of this distillery called. La Capilla, la distillerie La Capilla, uh, and is sitting around more than 300 acres of agave mm. uh, in this top location. So I let you imagine that every day uh, you have big brands that want to uh, even buy the agave or buy the distillery and, mm. uh, and, and the landscape. Mm. Um, but uh, on Adelita, um, 